today we're going to show you an easy way to re-thread the holes located in a disc cutter crankcase that attaches the cylinder on a sash dolmar using an M5 by 0.8mm helicoil kit. This technique can be used for many different parts and machines to repair damaged threads. Before starting, you will need to determine the size of the helical needed to re-thread. In this video, we will be using an M5 by 0.8mm helical kit. As a top tip, a simple and cost-effective way to know how far to drill out a damaged thread is to measure the depth of the hole and mark this on the drill. Holding the part in place using a vise, drill out the hole using a power drill to the markings, identifying how far to drill to. Now using the tap from the helical kit, place this in a ratchet to easily re-thread the hole. Make sure that the tap is aligned correctly. Then slowly cut the new threads into the crankcase. Turn until you have re-threaded the hole and then release by unscrewing the ratchet. Now get the insulation tool and adjust so you know the measurement of the hole depth for the new insert. When you know the size, attach a spring on the end of the tool making sure the tang is in the slot. Now place this in the hole, twisting the new helical until it is secure. This should be half a turn below the surface. Do not twist against the direction of the thread as this could damage the spring. Then to remove the tang at the end of the spring, gently tap this with the brake tool provided. That's how you re-thread the holes located in a disc cutter crankcase on a sash dolmar using an M5 by 0.8mm helicoil kit. All the parts and tools needed for this task are listed in the description below. Please like, share and subscribe if you found this video helpful.